Hi, I'm Vicki Eisenstein with ID8 TV, and I'm at LA Comic Con, and I am right here with Byron and was it G? G. G. G like the letter? G like the letter. G golly gosh. And they are of Dead <laughs> by Midnight, which is, they're, you're a band. We're a band. And you're a comic? We are. We are an animated comic book rock band. International super spies who travel through time, rocking the world, and saving the day. Are you allowed to tell me your spies? Am I allowed to tell you? That you're spies. Are you allowed to tell We're me your spies? Fighters. Crime so fighters. I wouldn't say spies. I'd say uh, more like, think James Bond. Okay. That's really what we are. Gotcha. Where James Bond meets Muse meets Depeche Mode all roll into one and a great comic. Gotcha. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> when did you guys get together? About 18 months ago now. 18 okay. months. So you're a newer band. Yeah, we're brand new. Brand new. So our first Comic Con. The uh, We're now on uh, chapter one that's just been released so we've got uh, volume zero that's been out now we've got chapter 1.1 all out online animation it's very fun two more chapters two more two more chapters to come in this story which is called feed the machine where we travel to 2089 shankau the last remaining city after the nuclear war and we go there to well we're not going to tell you the whole story we go there to bring down the evil drug empire <laughs> but and to rock at the same time right yeah, yeah we rock the world we rock now, did you two meet through music and start with music, or did you start as comic book fans? How did this come about? Music. Music was the easy part, the fun bit. And then we started to get deep into rum, and then into comic, and then into storyline, and animation. And now we've just created this beast called Dead by Midnight. And the great thing is, but we do love whole the comics. Obviously, we grew up with comics in the UK, the Beano, the Dandy, all that stuff. And we wanted to make a comic that was authentic. So we spent a lot of time working on the story, the, the arc, the depth of characters. So it's kind of like Deadpoolish because they were a bit naughty, a bit flawed, and but it's time we're traveling. We're human. We're human. It's Every our fantasy life. Everyone's isn't it? got flaws. Have you got flaws? No. no oh, are you human? Well, I'm not going to answer that on camera. <laughs> but that's really cool, you guys. So what's what's in store next then? Where are you going with this all? Live shows. We have an immersive live show experience where we basically we show the comic, the animated comic, and then we come out of that and play a gig. We bring the comic to life. Yeah. That is really awesome. Yeah. Like November, just around the corner. November. Two Bit Circus in downtown LA. Oh, okay. We're doing a whole immersive. Our, our live show is an immersive experience of comic live band and a little bit of partying. What's your favorite comic book? Oh, tricky I'm, one. I'm Deadpool. I'm sorry, I'm Deadpool. I'm well, why are you sorry? Well, you Shouldn't know what, be. around here there's a lot of Deadpools walking around, oh, right? So, okay. but it's fun. Different shapes, sizes, colors, having a laugh, having a party, <laughs> DBM party. Um, you know, so that's my kind of thing. Yeah, I was always a big fan of the Beano growing up. The Beano, and more recent times, I have to say, Deadpool Banana as well. Man. Banana Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anything, to be honest. I mean, loved Star Wars, of course. Star Wars, Star, say on. Star Wars, it's hard not to be a Star Wars fan. And know. then how about your favorite band? Dead by Midnight. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I'm sorry, that, that, that... No, you don't get to say yourselves. How long have we got? No, because we are a mix. I'm going to say something that's going to upset him. But I'm going to say the Beatles, because yeah, the Beatles. there really is only one band, right? Ten yeah. years? How many albums? Ten albums? I mean, they're my mom's favorite band. Oh, that's nice. Is your mom here? No, she's not. Sorry. Does she like Dead by Midnight? Uh, I'll have to introduce you guys she to her. She love <laughs> Dead by Midnight. She'd love it. We are, are my favorite. I always grew up with English electronic music, so OMD, Depeche, all that stuff. But you grew up with a bit of a more of a rock influence, yeah, right? A bit you more know, the Oasis pop stuff. Yeah. So we're a, we're a blend of all those things. So we don't sound like anybody, but we sound like the stadium version of everyone. So come and see us live, everybody. Yeah, so where should they go in order to follow you, find tickets? dbmband.com is the website. And if you want to follow us on anything, at Dead by Midnight Band. Great. Well, thank you guys so much for letting me interview you. Thank you. Rock and roll, everybody. Right on. DBM party. <laughs> I've been Vicki Eisenstein with ID8 TV. And make sure that you like this video, that you hit subscribe, and watch our other interviews. And follow them. <laughs>